Would you give me money? I would. To help your campaign? Yes, I would. Because I don't have much money as a independent. <laughs> <laughs> Put together a list of every human being you've ever met in your life. One of the things I might say is maybe you shouldn't run. Gun control is definitely something that you're going to have to comment on. These are my potential voters in the 5th District of Virginia. What should I say to them? Hi, I'm Bob. I am running. Running for Iowa's open seat in the U.S. Senate. During the election season, American TV screens are full of political ads like this, with more money than ever funding online ads. If you are the sexual predator and sociopath who murdered my sister Lynette, and you come to my front door to do harm to my girls, I'm going to use my Glock. Millions of dollars are spent getting the message out. And then there's the political speech. If there is anyone out there who still doubts that America is a place where all things are possible, who still wonders if the dream of our founders is alive in our time, who still questions the power of our democracy, tonight is your answer. I've hired speechwriter Bob Lehrman for my campaign. He used to work with former Vice President Al Gore. I asked him to write a standard speech to try out on some university students in my district. Get us interested with some interesting story, something that's local. Yep. They won't say, oh, how did she know all this stuff? She must be reading about Virginia for years. They'll know that you just cared enough to look up and find out what the, what the details are. Open with that. Hello. Hi, everyone. Um, do you want to hear the good news or the bad news about your university? Bad news. Bad news. Bad news. Bad news. Okay. Your football team isn't very good. Do you want to hear the good news? What? Your coach is gone. Yay. Then talk about the problems. Uh, that you see and the reason that you're a candidate, outline some solutions, uh, give us a kind of inspirational uh, close where you might have a story about uh, something also local or something that you've seen that moves people, and then call them to action. I could tell the story of my high school friend who is a Vietnamese refugee. So um, are they boat people? Yes. Okay. She was actually a boat person. I think that should be at the end of your speech. Great. Another area where President Obama is using executive action. I went to high school with a very good friend. She was a Vietnamese boat person. She came to America fleeing the Vietnamese war. Mm. You should Google. Find out what she's doing. Let me see if I've missed... Uh, Oh, do you have a favorite joke? I'm so bad at jokes. Um, so President George W. Bush was asked, um, why does America have such a big trade deficit? And his answer was, because more and more of our imports are coming from abroad. <laughs> and the cost of a speechwriter? $30,000. Exactly. I would never buy a pennant, ever. And it's illegal. The world can treat you bad. I'm Linda Yu, and I endorse this message.